Hey guys, how y'all doing? I'm here to give you guys a recap on the new episode of Dragon Ball Super, which is on episode 115. This episode right here is actually pretty um, obvious to a start if you guys watched it. And the way how it ended, I could see a lot of people could be complaining about a couple things here and there. But you know, there's one thing in particular. There's one guy who's waking up from meditation. That is all I can really give you for the fact. It didn't happen in this episode, but minor spoiler ahead. Obviously, if you even watch it after you will know what I'm talking about, it'll happen in the next episode. So, if anything else, let's go. Pretty much in this episode, we have to it that Goku goes up against Kefla. Vegeta almost got his butt handed to Topo because he was distracted. As for Android 18, she almost got um, annihilated but gets saved by Android 17 who says who's just passing by. And when it comes to the Polterra fusion, Zen Chan. Or Zen, I don't even know why I even said Zen Chan, who is pretty much useless in a in a crazed up little child child like king whatsoever. Pretty much says fusion potato seems fun. I'm thinking in my mind, oh my gosh, are you freaking kidding me? Are you freaking kidding me? This is like beyond <laughs> what the hell, dude. So aside from that, um, it was pretty much Goku against Kefla in his Super Saiyan Blue form, and of course. Goku does, like, um, stand up to Kefla for a bit. And then by the time, of course, Kefla managed to stand up against Goku in Super Saiyan Blue, in, Su in her Super Saiyan Legendary Super Saiyan form, against Goku, Bl Goku's Super Saiyan Blue form, etc. But in the end, towards the end of the episode, Goku gets knocked out by one kick, but all of a sudden, he's not going to get knocked out yet. And of course, Jiren, he started to twitch a bit in this episode. But later on, Goku ends up breaking through his shell again, which is what, which is which is what he did when he said he's not gonna give up. Even we says he just broke through a shell, and Beerus is like, "Yeah, I want to see this thing, Ultra Instinct." And the preview of the next episode obviously shows that Goku is going up against Kefla in his Ultra Instinct form, and the episode does show that Jiren wakes up from his meditation, which shows that he's ready to like him fight Goku again, possibly. But I don't know about that for sure. I mean, I'm pretty sure like those of you guys who've been doing research and keeping up with certain spoilers about Dragon Ball Super's episode in the future would know what's bound to happen, but yeah. Anyways, this fight is just about Kefla versus Goku, but Goku gets beaten in the end, even though he did stand equal ground and match to overpower Kefla. He does get knocked out by a kick, but ends up waking up in his Ultra Instinct form, which I'm trying to understand how the hell does that even work. But also, Jiren does also wake up from his meditation though. Um, in the next next preview of the episode. So looking forward to that. So until then, I'll see you guys in my next video. So I'm off of zero people. Have a good day. And I'll see you guys next time. Alright? Peace out. Bye bye. Toot -toot -toot.